Hey guys, so um, yes, hello to you if you're a new subscriber. Um, I probably look horrifying right now because I just got back from I just got back from an e from an event and I am very tired right now actually. Uh, but I really really want to show you guys um, how I remove all of this makeup. The reason why I'm doing it today um, because I have probably a full makeup on with lashes, eyelid tape and everything and I also want to share with you guys the products that I am currently loving and yeah and this is my own personal way of removing my makeup so the products that I'm going to show you today they work well on me and they might not work well on you because you know, everyone has different uh, different type of skin, and yeah. So please do deep research before um, buying them. Before I start, I just want to tell you guys that my skin is oily, and right now um, it is breaking out because you know PMSing, and yeah. Okay, so the first thing that I do, I'm going to take off my lashes and my eyelid tape, and I have a mirror there, so I'm just going to keep on looking at that side. So I'm just going to take. Um, my lashes off. Yes, you just can tell that I look different without lashes. And then I'm going to take off my eyelid tape. You guys can tell from this, <laughs> I do have a very oily eyelid. So, yeah. Okay, so this is my face. Um, the first thing that I'm going to do, well, the first thing that I always do is to remove all of um, the makeup from my um, skin except for the eye makeup area, you know, on the eye area because I'm going to use a different type of, uh, what do you call, product. So the first thing that I do is I usually use um, cleansing water. This is from Bioderma. This is Sabium. Sabium, yeah. And I actually use um, another one. I think it was called Sensi Bio. I don't know. I forgot. But it was the pink cap. Uh, the reason why I picked this one is because I think this is much more suitable for my oily skin. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour some onto the cotton pad, and I'm just going to um, wipe it away onto my skin. I used to um, I used to use the Biore um, wipes, the makeup remover wipes, but I thought you know I thought to myself that that is kind of a waste. So I still love it, but I only use the Biore wipes whenever I go traveling, and usually I apply like twice just to make sure that everything's must of the makeup is off which I don't think I mean they're not like off off from your skin but you know it is much more better and once the base makeup is done I am going to take the Etude House lip and eye remover the reason why I'm using this for my eyes um, is because this has the power and strength to remove the eyelash glue and what I do is like just dip it leave it for a few seconds and then remove it the hardest part when you apply um, falsies is the removing, I mean the glue removal well, at least it is for me. Okay, so once the eye makeup is done, I am going to continue using my uh, Menard Sukika Cleansing Cream. And I'm just going to apply it a tiny bit, like that much. I'm just going to apply it onto my skin. Just to make sure that, you know, it cleanses the skin really, really well. So what I do now is I'm just going to spread this all over my skin you guys can apply it onto the eyelids if you guys want it's really up to you 
and usually I have this um, bottle of water um, spray and I'm just going to spray it all over my skin there are different ways on how you guys can apply this but this is just my own personal way so yeah and I feel that my makeup comes off really easily when I do this then again take a cotton pad and I'm just, I'm just remove the cleansing cream away from your skin I always do is um, wash my face so I'm just going to wash my face and yeah um, I'm done basically after washing the face you see I'll apply my night cream and keep getting ready for bed and yeah I hope you enjoyed this quick and short um, video on how I remove my makeup um, do subscribe and give this a thumbs up and I shall see you guys with my next video bye